aid in Sarajevo. As well as water, the city was today running short on flour. But how to deliver that aid safely is still the subject of fierce debate. The Foreign Office today urging extreme caution on the question of using ground forces. And as the conflict continues, many analysts believe that amid such chaos, trade sanctions will have little impact. The only pressure the Serbs will understand, they say, is military. For 45 years, Muslims, Serbs and Croats lived in peace in Bosnia, the capital Sarajevo, a model of ethnic harmony. Now, Serbs are systematically shelling the Muslims' mosques, their stores, their homes, and now hundreds of years of their history have gone up in smoke with the city library. It seems a whole culture is being destroyed. But the relentless attack on their humanity has produced a deep terror that even the best of intentions may never uproot. Who brave the gunfire, they see a city riddled with bullets. Inside the damaged buildings, most of those killed in the fighting lie unburied. Conditions for the 380,000 people in and around Sarajevo were made yet worse when the water supply, which runs through a Serb-controlled suburb, was cut off. 